So guys, there's a lot of drama going on uh, right now, and I think the overarching message here is to not believe um, stuff unless there's like actually like hard facts and like allegations going down. We watched the Banks' video where he talks about his side of the story. I'm Logan Paul. All I'm gonna say is this, guys. I hate choosing sides. I, f I, I, I really hate choosing sides, regardless if it's my brother or not. I love my brother, but at the same time, there's reasons I've made diss tracks against him. However, I do, I do love facts and hard evidence. I listen really well, I process information really well, and then I make assumptions and my opinions based on that. One thing that stuck out to me, I said this in my vlog, uh, about the whole bank situation is that he never denied th what was the issue at hand in the first place, which was that your assistant w had been grabbed or touched by him in some way. I'm just saying that stuck out to me as it, like, like it, it was never, Explicitly, he never explicitly said, I did not do that. Because he did. Uh, and, and the police are getting involved into that. I hate to have this like conversation again with you, because it's like so, like I know it's tragic, and uh, you're okay though, right? Yeah, I'm okay. Jake Ballers know that she's okay. Which is the whole reason why this all started in the first place, is, was to raise awareness about like humans assaulting humans in general. And so I think everyone has lost track of that, and lost how that is the most important message here. Something I brought up, and uh, again, like, I'm gonna be honest, you Jake, that you just, you're taking my vlog, but it's whatever. Uh, and my vlog was, uh, Banks denies kissing any girls at the club. Why did you say that you saw him kissing a girl? Because I saw him. I saw him from above, and I, my friend said, that's Banks. And I said, there's no way that's Banks because he's kissing another girl. Is there any, ch like, what was the angle? Is there any chance he was, like, leaning over a girl, or like, like, how do you know that their lips were making contact? I mean, we saw it. Like, they You were, saw lips on lips? Yeah. That was the angle? We he, saw, like, faces to faces. His back wasn't to you or anything? No. Guys, all of, and I, I think even this is a good example. Bro, I'm just asking like, questions, no, no, no. bro. I'm just like, I, like even, what, even what they say, it's all hearsay. Banks can have anyone say anything. He's tweeting about, like, people defending him, people saying this, people saying that. I'm, I'm vlogging with my brother. I want to get to the hard facts and tell you guys that you shouldn't believe stuff unless there's hard proof. In their video, Alyssa goes on to say that I assaulted her and did all of these things to her. And it's all just hearsay. There's no proof, there's no evidence. And what's crazy about this whole entire thing is that my relationship with Alyssa was actually the other way around and she was abusive to me. I never laid a single finger, finger on Alyssa. She made this whole video uh, some of you have probably saw it about her telling the truth about the situation and why she left the Team 10 house. In there, she never mentioned being assaulted. She never mentioned being spit on. She never mentioned any of these things. She never said anything about that in her video, which, and now all of a sudden she wants to talk about how I did that? It is a bit, it's a, it's a bit weird how, and it, it is also so easy to just keep adding things on. Like you, you think should, people can say whatever they want, unless I it's just, facts. I, I would have assumed the case was closed, right? And then it just, now that it, things are heating up again, it's so easy to be like, oh yeah! Again, like I'm trying to be unbiased here, I'm just saying that's what I think. They had this like whole story on how I did this and this and this. And when you lie once in your story, I think all of your credibility goes out the door. The next part of this is a complete joke. They said that I assaulted Erica and that I've spit on Erica and that I've done all these crazy things to her when she is like literally like one of the people who I love the most in this world and like for her them to even say that, how would they even know that? Who do you love the most in this world? You. And the Jake Paulers. I'm gonna call Erica. Yo. Yo, I know uh, I know we had this conversation on Logan's video, um, but I just wanna uh, I have it again for the Jake Paulers and and so that they hear it from you Faze and Alyssa said that I assaulted you and spit on you. Can you tell me if that's true? You could be open and honest feel free f for this to be like your platform uh, to say whatever you want Literally you've never touched me spit on me even said like a disrespectful thing to me like Really ever so I don't know where the hell any of this information is coming from but it needs, to be, it needs to go away. All right, thank you, Erica. So, you heard it there. Hey, hey, I'm making a video. I'm bored, I've been trying to leave for eight years, bro. Okay, leave, uh, no, leave, leave. No, no, I'll help you, I'll help you to the end. You heard it from Erica, I've never even laid a finger on her. So that just shows that like when they lie once, all of their credibility goes out the door, and we know that I've never assaulted Alyssa, all of these other things. 
uh, and so the whole situation to me is just absurd. And again, guys, I think we're all getting away from the point that I made this video about that situation to raise awareness. Like, it is not okay for a human to assault another human, which is the overarching message of this whole entire thing, which is why I made the video in the first place. It's not, to, it's to, not, it's not okay to get aggressive like that with people. Exactly. They're trying to smoke in mirrors, everyone, to not look at that situation. That is what happened. Alyssa, whatever, these people can say whatever they want. We have hard facts. We're telling the truth. Uh, and again, I didn't want this to go here. I just wanted to change the world and make it a better place. And the fact that they try and spin it on me is just absurd. And it, and it really pisses me off. And anyone who's like going like with that or running with that wind is like, you guys need to listen to the hard facts and all of the hearsay, unless there's evidence, I would tell you to take it as BS. That being said, I'm out of here. Me too. I'm, I'm leaving first. Jake Paulers, we gotta hit a flight. We're about to perform a sold out show tomorrow. Dab on them haters. You already know we got the hottest merch in the game. Always plug. Cop yourself.